Welcome to Uncle Brent's Shed. Today we crack that roller door after 15 years and get a car running. Well, as you can see, it's uh, nature's trying to take over. That old man's home there. So the plan is to, um, to get it running. Uh, not sure if I'm going to move it out of here yet, but we'll work that out um, as we go. Obviously, all the tyres are flat. I know it does drive, but it's got no. Obviously, it's not going to have any brakes and whatnot. So we'll just play it um, as we go. Station sedan. Do you know that's awesome? I'm trying to have a hold of Now, some of you keen-eyed people might have noticed, it doesn't have a roof, and it is a two-door. And she's, um, uh, it's... I was gonna say all there, but it's, you know, 75% there. Um, probably wouldn't take too much to um, get it fully operational. I can't remember. I'm pretty sure it has no brake stuff under the bonnet at all. So we'll pop that bonnet now and have a gander. Hey dog, yeah. So we do have brats here in Australia, but they don't seem to be that out of control. But um, I remember having a box of Sol Solvo soap that went empty. It must have tasted good, so they've uh, hidden it up here and yeah, used it as a hotel. situation um, nothing that's a bit neat let me get some for that might need to get some compressed air blow that carby out hopefully I can reach it from over there and I'll blow these tyres up as well alright bear with me Watch your, your eyes. <laughs> oh. Yeah, minty. Probably all just running into the sump. <laughs> I said it's probably running into the sump, eh? Probably filling up all the pots, eh? <laughs> Put a 
rebuilt things in it, don't they? Yeah. Well, probably 30 years ago. <laughs> yeah. Still needs a bit of oil. Oh, just a bit. Probably similar to what you just poured in. I would always put like a block of cheese sitting on the bottom, hey? Mm. Oh, yeah. yeah. We just got it. Big lump. Here. Big lump. It's smart. Um, should pump these tyres up so we can get a bit of height in the front end. That thing's stuck in that cupboard yeah. there. Yeah. Yeah. See how many don't pump up, eh? All of them. <laughs> Blowing air straight out the back of it, eh? You. Oh, yeah. You see the air blowing in? Yes, yeah. One. One. One's better than none. Could probably do it. This might be a bit um, fragile, you know? Probably roll off the edge of the concrete and pop out. Yeah. Same thing, eh? Mm-hmm. It's good. What's that doing? I don't know. It's like a block here, eh? Same? Yeah. I got your valve tool. Get him on, mate. Is this battery gonna be flat? Oh, it's sparkling in your tire, eh? <laughs> so just listen all to listen them all. <laughs> so the straight ends can see if I can. Do you see the final start melting? It's the right thing that's eating everything out or what? Should we just cut straight to it and just pour fuel in there? I don't even know if the ignition's on. Just pour some in there and we'll and hit her again. Yeah, that'll probably <laughs> That'll do it, I reckon. Last time I did this, I was about 16, I reckon. In that hose? No, you would have been about no, six. I was pouring a drink into a funnel for someone. Oh. <laughs> 
Yeah, last time I seen this running, I can remember just peeking over the radiator support. Yeah. See a little spider with the spun up in the bloody fan. <laughs> in the driveway at the old house. I'll give it another tweak then. Oh, and the throttle pump's working. Yeah. <laughs> seen one of these before it's a cable lubricator so you poke your little nozzle in there off your spray can small end of the cable there big one there and then you just clamp it down and it supposedly seals it all we'll give it a crack just a feeder in like that Deep that goes. Must only go to there. Designed for motorbike cables, memory. You should probably go inside and finger fudge the throttle and all the cable out here and then free it up. See, someone did a burnout on the highway or what? Where? Up there? Another one? No. <laughs> Good, eh? Yeah. It's a little bit firm, but... Yeah, probably because I'm yanking on it. 
I'm not Derek from Bicycle Garage's Don. Mm. I hate seeing you in the bedroom. Yeah? I'm mm. proud of Coming from the best. I can't them. turn it off and the throttle jams. I'll just have to crash in or something. Yeah. They need to crash in here. Oh. oh. Careful, mate, you'll flood it. Just needs brakes, man, eh? And she's. And Rego. Alright. Gonna attempt to drive it. Got the fuel system sorted. What's going on with that battery tray? I don't know man, I was looking at it before, it's all busted up. Busted up. Let it over too far and something charged from it. Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah, that's not Wow! Jesus. I don't really want to sit in here, eh? Inside the entire. Oh no, got fuel. Stinks like 50 year old. Hotness. Oh, I gotta start it for you. Oh, there's my ignition switch there. Hang it down. Yeah. I wonder why that wasn't doing anything. You gonna fill that while we're driving around? Yeah. You're driving down the block, eh? <laughs> yeah, splashed with fuel. Yeah. <laughs> Ready, bro? Yeah. <laughs> oh, still in gear. <laughs> nah, she's in gear, bros. <laughs> Big uh, box section that, eh? thing underneath. 
But yeah, Todd, you get pushed by me. So much for this being a 10 minute video. Yeah. I've got the patrol here. Yeah, we'll, we'll do all the pump up. Uh, we might try with those front tyres though. <laughs> yeah, that's, uh, that's not gonna work. All the tires are off the rims. Yeah, this one is. <laughs> oh man. I might have to do the old fire thing and all, you know, like lube them up and set them on fire. <clears throat> Pardon me. You know what you should do? Take one spark plug out with a long lead. Some phenomenon. Mm. Might have to give it a crack. Oh. <laughs> yeah, well, we fucking space and something else. Oh, push it back and forth. Flamey boy. Or a fucking wire off the plug, mate, like you said. It's never been done before. <laughs> Do you like that? Huh? <laughs> so, um, obviously, we've got a flat tyre. My lad come up with an idea. We're going to pour fuel in there, you know, your lighter. We've come up with the old welding rod on the plug lead. So, we're going to give that a shot. Yes. Oh. All right. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that worked better than I thought, but um, went straight back down. Ah, hold oh. that, I'm getting zapped. Ah, oh. <laughs> 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 ow! I knew it would do that to you, eh? Frick. <laughs>
Hey, he hit bumps on He's gonna go. Yeah, I'll go get it. in that bloody dash, hey? It's... <laughs> Too much momentum trying to drive and record. And the budgie in the bloody dashboard. Chicken's gone. It's got a water leak at the fuel pump. Sorry, the water leak at the water pump. So she's getting worse. Run out of fuel, and she's run out of fuel. But no, it runs smooth enough. There's not even a fuel pump here today. I can see the bloody. What? Oh, time jam. I can see in the hole there. fuel pump in it. <laughs> Alright, so I've had a bit of a lunch break. A bit of a time to think how to finish off this video. Might, um, some of you have probably noticed that it's got 
the headlights are sitting really weird because I think it's got the wrong mud guards on it. <clears throat> Those headlights are supposed to sit in right next to the grill. So they're probably VF guards that are supposed to have the round headlights. That's what I'm thinking. Anyway, I think this video has turned from a will it run and drive video into will it do a burnout? <laughs> but I can't um, I can't pop them tyres because I don't have any 14 inch tyres left so we'll probably just um, yeah go and do a bit of a skid and then have a bit of a tidy up and then that's probably the end of the video so now someone wants to help me because she's claimed the car already, so perfect. Yeah, give her a bit more. Give the front a okay. soap up. Yeah. Bit higher. Yeah. Perfect. I'll let them rat turds soak for a bit. Then you can wash it off. Smells all right, eh? Yeah. That'll do. You can start scrubbing now. I was about to throw a belt, eh? Hey? <laughs> Good stuff. <laughs> nice job, Santa. Ben. Thanks for tuning in, Uncle Brent's shed. Hope you, uh, well, you wouldn't have learnt nothing, but uh, hope you enjoyed. Um, you might see this in the future. Got a few, obviously, other jobs to do on it, so see how we go with that. Still, obviously, working on the charger. Also, found some terraplane parts, enough parts to actually get it running again. So, that's going to be a bonus. And the blokes sell our stuff cheap, so it's all just second hand used stuff so that's exactly what we want for that so yeah cheers for watching again and look after your mates cheers <laughs>